Ladies and gentlemen, Michael Palmisano here. Hope you're having a great day. Uh, Instagram, GuitarGate. TikTok, GuitarGate. Website, GuitarGate. Peloton, GuitarGate. Follow me. Um, back on my email here, and I get one from Matt Glavin. Uh, some of you out there may remember Matt. Um, I featured him on the channel not too long ago. Uh, he wrote a song um, about his grandparents' love letters that he found uh, from, I believe, World War II. Uh, amazing, amazing dude, okay? He says, dude, serious request, this one is important. If you haven't listened to this guy already, you have to. It's Ian No. He's got a new album on the way. It's a force to be reckoned with. Thank you so much, and wishing your family all the best. Dude, sold. I've definitely heard some Ian No. Um, I don't know if I've seen this one, but this is, let's bring it up, if today doesn't do me in, Check out oh my this. gosh, of course, of course. I'm never logged in. I'm never logged in to the right one. There we go. So I don't have to have the ads. If today isn't do me in, Jam in the Van Headquarters 2019. All right, hit me. G. So far, you gotta get the product placement in as you do. You know? I'm Ian No, and I'm jamming in the van. This first song is called If Today Doesn't Do Me In. In a heavy rain standing off an old county road Set a high rolling river so swift There was a hitchhiking stranger Quite pale from the cold On a cane trying to thumb down a lift Oh yeah, this is this is awesome. All right, real quick, I think I have a capo here. Um, basically, uh, you don't need a capo, but he's got capo first fret. Uh, what's happening here is I'll give you the enharmonically correct thing first is you're actually in the key of C. Um, and so it goes C, so one. Then it goes to, uh, sorry, I'm going to speak enharmonically correct. Come on, Michael. C sharp. Down to F. I guess it's actually, you know, this is one of those weird things. If you choose C sharp, right, this should be an E something, right? But you're actually on the first fret. So it'd be F, so E sharp. I know, I know. I know, but it's a three. It's a three, baby, right? Now, F sharp, uh, that's your four chord, and back to one. That's your first thing. Then it goes from one, down to six, down to five, down to four. But if you have your capo on the first fret, come on, it looks like your C shape, right? E shape. F shape, so one, three, four, and then one, six, five, four. Let's start it over, out of respect for the man. Here we go. In a heavy rain standing off an old county road, set a high rolling river so swift. Was a hitchhiking stranger, quite pale from the cold. Yeah. On a cane, trying to thumb down a lift. Mm. Well, I pulled up beside him and let my window on down to the rain and the bone chilling wind. And said, You look awful warm in this late winter storm. Which way are you headed, my friend? Love that. Right up to the spotlight Drinking all that coke and gin And I'll be a suit wearing man With gold in my hand If today doesn't do me in I love, uh, Ian, I love your whole vibe. Um, from a guitar picking standpoint, I love how you're, um, uh, 
what's the word I'm looking, displacing uh, the bass note, the middle, and the treble part, right? It, you're, you're, you're distinctly hearing uh, a bass, middle, melody, right? Um, so like instead of just going, you know, just drumming the whole thing, you get, you get that. So like bass, middle, middle, treble, middle, middle, bass, middle, middle, treble. Now he's articulating it way more than that, but I'm trying to get you to start thinking about how you have a low section, a middle section, and a high section. So it's so, you, it's so easy as acoustic guitar players and singer-songwriters to just strum the whole chord every time. But getting the little intricacies of a low, middle, and high part of the, of the chord is your building block to then start adding the melodies on top. So that's when you start seeing them do stuff like... Right? Now I just stayed on one chord. I didn't hit, hit go through all the changes, but you get what I'm trying to say. So I love that. Second, the tone. Totally love your tone. I love that super, the draw of your delivery is so sharp on the nose, right? It's like, it's very John Prine-esque in, in that sense. Um, and I just can't wait to see where this goes. Behind the gas station counter, moving crates full of things that look far too heavy for her. Mm. That's what that's what I mean about straight on the nose, like John Prine. It's like it could be anything. Then then for her, it got it. The 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 whole line is a precursor to the to the punctuation, which is those last two um, two words. And it sharps right on the nose it's to her, and and immediately you see her there with the crates struggling down. Right, it, immediately you don't see anything until that. That, that um, again, uh, words can be punctuation, should be punctuation in songs. It's important to think about it like that. There's still a girl with a frown said, "Let me just sit these down, and I'll be right with you, sir." I said, no, hey, here, take all the time that you want. She said, a little time, and you just wait and see. Oh, I'll be without a care when I finally get there. I said, miss, tell me where my that be. Right up to the spotlight, drinking all that Coke and gin. Be a dress wearing girl with the hills and the pearls. If today doesn't do me in, well, now what you got? If today doesn't do me in. So, step one, you got the hitchhiker, right? Trying to catch a ride. Sure does look nice and warm inside, you know? I'm gonna be in that spotlight drinking that Coke and gin if today doesn't do me in. Part two, right? Going in the gas station, you got the girl. Working, working, working real hard, right? Doing something just to get by, right? Where are you gonna go if I give you a little help? You know, I'm gonna be in that spotlight, drinking that Coke and gin, if today doesn't do me in. Now, where are you gonna go? What are we gonna do? We need a flip. Great shirt. Well, I got a head full this morning. Cutting out through the fog You know I can't help but wonder what's left From every road that dead ends To those old bitter men Passing time on the old courthouse steps And there's a feeling you get Not far from despair That sometimes sets in on your mind But if it's all that you've got Still set the clock and get up with a reason to climb. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Right up to the spotlight, drinking all that Coke and gin. And I'll leave these shadows behind if 
for a new peace of mind if today doesn't do me in. Love that. If today doesn't do me in. The spotlight, leave the shadows behind if today doesn't move me in. Uh, or do me in. Keep going. Come on. Love it. You guys know how I feel about songs that paint pictures, right, of people. Now, that you had a perfect representation of, of uh, three different walks of life, if you will. Uh, all wanting to work towards something instead of just working. Just trying to build something, to go somewhere, to be somebody, instead of just existing. Sometimes you got to punch the clock to not have to do it anymore, right? You got to keep lifting those crates. You got to do the manual labor until you don't need to anymore. If you're completely broke and you have nothing and you are hitching rides, you got to do that until you don't need to anymore to get where you're going. The point is, it reminds me of the Shawshank Redemption. You getting busy living or you getting busy dying? Are you working towards something or are you just working? Think about it. Are you just doing time out there? Wind's at our back, ladies and gentlemen. The wind is at our back right now. Love you all so much. Thanks for watching. Thanks for liking. Hope you subscribe. It really helps the algorithm. Um, thank you very much, Matt, for sending this to me. And uh, for everybody out there that's a, a GuitarGate subscriber on the website uh, or on here on YouTube or Instagram or wherever, um, thank you so much for the support. I love you. I appreciate you. Have a great day. And that's it. Cheers.